Six months have passed since the cottage next to the Prospect Harbor Lighthouse caught fire in Goldsboro. Since then, the town and the historical society have spoken out in favor of the full restoration of the cottage by sending a petition to state representative Jared Golden. It is a, it's a landmark, it's a, a historic landmark, and we don't really want to see it the, uh, demolished or destroyed. That's Ray Mathewson, the vice president of the Goldsboro Historical Society and one of the individuals who spearheaded the petition to restore Gull's Cottage. The petition is all the town can do for the historic cottage because it's actually owned by the U.S. Navy, so they can't take any action of their own. All very enthusiastic about signing the petition. A lot of people were not even uh, full-time residents here. They were summertime residents, who, and they were all very, very supportive of it. It was very important to them to uh, restore that keeper's house. Recently, the Historical Society was given hope when workers began constructing a temporary roof over the cottage. When we reached out to the Navy to ask if any decision had been made for the cottage, Jeremy Lambert of the Portsmouth Naval Shipyard responded by stating, The Navy's decision on the future of Gull Cottage has not been made. However, he did also say, The Navy must consider effects on historic properties and will provide an opportunity for interested parties and the public to participate in a consultation to identify and evaluate these effects. The Navy anticipates the engagement effort will begin in spring 2023. According to Mathewson, his work is far from over. We will plan to attend those meetings when and if they happen. Uh, they have been appropriately coming to the select board meetings uh, several times uh, since it happened. You know, we obviously can't get old beams and old wood and everything in there, but we'd like to restore it as much as possible to the original as is condition. For ABC7 and Fox 22, I'm Devin Dagnalt.